Welcome back everyone. A super quick tutorial on exactly how to screenshot on any Windows PC, whether it's Windows 10 or Windows 8. I'm pretty sure it's going to be most successful on Windows 10, but it'll also work with Windows 7 and, and all those different Windows OSs as well. So there's two main ways to going about it. And I think there's screenshotting software as well out there for Windows, but the main way that I used to do it was using the snipping tool. So what you can do is click on the search bar on the bottom or click the Windows button and just search up snipping tool. Now I always hated that name. I hate that name so much. It makes me feel so uncomfortable. But pretty much at this point, once you have that tool open, you can click the new button. And I think there's actually going to be an update for snipping tool coming out soon too. But once you click new, it'll allow you to highlight a certain portion of the screen or whether you want all of it, you can highlight whatever you want. And then once you do that, a little dialog box will come up and then you can go into click on it and, and the snipping toolbox gives you the options of whether you want to save it out or if you want it or if you want to just copy it if you want to paste it on an email or something so so that's a really cool way of going about it there's a little bit more functionality in that sense but it is an extra step you do have to save it out to a whole different file name and all that the better way to do it though that takes up a lot less time would probably be the keyboard shortcut method and what this does is pretty much you click the windows button and the print screen button that's on most keyboards and then you can just basically go and just take a screenshot that way now i've tried this many times and sometimes it just doesn't work and for me personally i do use boot camp on my macbook in order in order to load up into windows so i don't necessarily have like a designated windows computer so my computer is a little bit confusing sometimes but even on mine i think i was able to go click the windows button and the print screen button have it working that way so those are two different ways to go about doing it again they both have their pros and cons the windows print screen takes a screenshot of the whole entire window but snipping tool gives you the option of you know copying certain portions of the screen and kind of going from there but within windows print screen you can also go and crop it down if you're in paint or anything like that too so that's really pretty much it a quick little tutorial if you guys have any other questions or anything let me know in the comment section below hit the like button that would mean so much but definitely hit that subscribe button every single subscriber that we get really does count so it means so much if you guys could hit that also check out the other links down in the description as well my twitter my instagram my second channel all, all those links are linked down below i'd really appreciate it if you guys would check it out more importantly than everything else i love every single one of you guys hopefully i'll catch you guys in the next video peace out till then